way? Let's go. Partner. this to your sound tactics.
Over here! Huh? <laughs> No, man. <laughs> well, what? Located a power spot. Shall we go to it? There are two enemies. We get the chance to attack first. I'm ready. What are your orders? This is fire! All right, next! And that's a wrap! Ah, the sweet smell of victory! It's an enemy FOE. Stay on your guard. spots back. It's a single shadow. Don't let your guard down. This shadow shaped like a table. Settled that quickly. Zen! It's gotten stronger! Yes. This power is to protect you. Do you think there might be something here? Let's check it out.
from it. I see. What? What's that, punk? seems different. Go and she is curry. Try to keep it going. Perfection! Good, we won. Let's continue to work hard. We've grown even stronger. Looks like we still got a ways to go. Rei-chan, how are you doing? Are you scared? I'm scared, but I'll be okay. Uh, um, Yukiko-san, can I call you Yuki? Hmm? Uh, I mean, well, you're like a big sister to me. <laughs> Aw, of course you can. <laughs> I've always been drawn to this place. But I was too scared to explore it. But I'm okay now. I I'll be strong so you won't laugh at me for being scared, Yuki. I'd never laugh at you for that. If you're scared, you don't have to push yourself too hard, okay? Okay, thanks. It's been just me and Zen for so long. But now that you're all here, I'm really having fun. <laughs> Zen? W what's wrong? Does it hurt somewhere? No. I don't really understand. Ray, will you stay by my side? Mm-hmm, of course. Yuki-chan, will you stay by my side? That reminds me, neither Ray-chan nor Zenkun uses a persona. Will you please stop ignoring me? Persona? Oh, yes. You mean the power of the heart you use. It's true that Ray and I cannot use them. You can face off with shadows even without a persona. Seems very odd to me. I guess they're like me? I used to live in a place with shadows, and I didn't have a persona either. Huh, you're right. But you didn't actually fight them until you could summon one. Hmm, that's true too. I thought it might have been possible because of this strange place. There's something else mysterious about this. Why isn't our leader changing his personas? When we were in the TV world, 
he would frequently adopt all sorts of personas, no? A blank card? Is this the first time you're seeing this too? This does concern me. If you can only summon one persona here, that puts us at a severe disadvantage in battle. I think we should bring this up at the Velvet Room sooner than later. Very well. Let's head there at once. Same as... Let's go already! Huh? Doesn't that wall look a little different from the others? Melt if they pour salt on it? Oh. Oh. was too easy. Senpai, are you getting tired? Are you OK? 
okay? Shall we go then? Oh, there's an FOE! Let's go. These two doors. I keep thinking about them. Yes, they are locked, and so I do not know where they lead. But I suspect... You suspect... One of them connects to the place where you belong. You're saying this is our exit? I sense familiar scents and sentiments from one of them, but... I think she's right. You do? What makes you say that? This room itself didn't exist until you came. To me, this is your place. And those doors there are also yours. But that's just a feeling I have. There's no evidence for it. Forget what I just said. Hmm. I had a feeling it wouldn't open. We'll just have to leave them for the time being. Nothing meaningless happens here. The door's role will surely make itself apparent in due time. Did you not have something else to talk about? As I recall, it was about the predicament of being unable to acquire new personas, no? Oh my! Were you eavesdropping? The lady with the supporting persona communicates with you from this room. I can't help but over here. Um, please ignore Teddy and continue. It seems I'll just have to take a look. Please have a seat over there. These are tarot cards. They are used to see within you. The tower. Hmm. Um. There's nothing wrong with the tower in and of itself. I'm more puzzled that it was not the fool. What's this fool thing? The fool is the number zero. It is the arcana that symbolizes the beginning and endless possibility. As it implies, my guests can wield endless personas. We call that ability the power of the wild card. The wild card? But his usual power seems to have changed. Perhaps it is the influence of this place. You apparently are unable to change from Izunagi here. So he cannot change it to something else? No. His power of the wild card has not been lost. To think that this would happen. In this possibility indeed. What is it? In addition to the persona he cannot change, it seems he can take on another persona. This other one can be summoned at will. He may change between them as he likes. So he can have two at the same time? But the changeable one cannot be fully expressed. Consider it as playing a supplemental part. If Izanagi is his main, then the changeable persona is his sub. He can use either as he pleases. That's the simplest explanation. Senpai sure is amazing. Ah, uh, but I believe there's more. The Fool. It's as I thought. W what do you mean? The favor of the Fool is showing on all of you. All of us? To have one persona as a main and a changeable one as a sub allowing the use of two at once. It seems you all are capable of this. W wait for real But what has caused such irregular behavior? It's as if the power of the fool has been strengthened. As if... There is another with the power of the wild guard. Could one of these two doors be... Huh? There's someone else with the wild card? Oh, no. It's nothing. Can Zen and I summon Personas too? Unfortunately, as neither of you had Personas to begin with, I think that will not be possible. Oh, but Personas are so cool! Why don't Zen and Raychan have Personas? 
I mean, they're fighting the shadows somehow. That is most likely closely tied to the mystery of this place. This is a haven in the rift, like a floating island adrift in the collective unconsciousness. Normally, it is no place for a living human. For one to be here, then perhaps they have taken on the qualities of being such as personas and shadows. Zenkun and Raychon are personas? That was only one possibility. For now, we can be certain of nothing. Now, do you happen to have one of these? I assume you have collected some from the shadows you fought. They are blank, indicating that they have not yet been guided to any specific destiny. Though previously you could only summon your individual personas, you can now summon others. If that is what fate has decreed, then these cards will fulfill their own rules. I recommend that you use these cards. They are your new Persona cards. So what do you think? That is all that I can tell you. Uh, so basically, we've all got the same thing going as my partner. A main Persona, a sub we can switch out, and we can take them both on at once. Seems so unreal. Huh? We're all following the same rules now? You'll always be my senpai! If you have trouble fighting the shadows, I recommend changing the personas you summon. Many of you are most likely unused to changing your personas, so you should try out several kinds. Well then, I bid you good luck. Welcome. I will see you again. Welcome. Will that be acceptable? I will see you again. 